So uh, what are some unique features about a shark? Well, the shark is a member of the cardioskeletal family, which means that their skeleton primarily is cartilage, except for their teeth and jaw bones. But what makes them enormously efficient, and they've been this efficient for at least 65 million years, as the fossil record indicates, is something called the, the ampullium of Lorenzini, which is a, an array capacity that literally runs the length of their body but aggregates the most densely in their snout and the purpose of this aggregation of sensory apparatus is to determine the uh, a multiple sensory level uh, 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 acceptability of a given prey. It's a series of mucus filled nerve canals which run the length of the body and the snout and as the shark brushes by or passes near its org the organism of question, it can determine its temperature, the electrical emanations of muscle contractions, it can determine density changes in the water around it as the organism thrashes if in distress, which heightens its likelihood as a, as a, as a, for an act of predation. So it's a very, very, very sophisticated a neurological uh, array that the, that the cardioskeletal organism carries. So basically what you just said, if I'm in trouble in the ocean, the a shark, shark knows. The shark's going to know it. The shark's going to know it. The shark's going to know it. The shark's going to know it uh, the way that Spock could read a planet with a tricorder. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wow. Are there any other um, of these kind of uh, unique features in the open water that, that uh, open water swimmers should know about? I would go so far as to suggest the other end of the spectrum. The open water swimmer really ought not to know about it because it would sorely detract from his sense of conviction that he's going to have to rely upon to complete the open water swim. If the open water swimmer were to, to associate and, and familiarize himself with the capability of most predators, apex predators in the ocean, he probably wouldn't get in. What's an apex predator? An apex predator is in the food chain, there are, uh, there's a hierarchy of organisms. An apex predator is what it, exactly what it means. It's at the very, very top of the food chain. The white shark, the mako, the hammerhead, um, the thresher on a smaller degree off these waters, but most definitely the white shark uh, is the apex predator. He's at the very top of the food chain. Now, even higher on that food chain is our friend the mammal, which we happen to be, and the orca, the killer whale. The killer whale makes short work of a white shark. Wow. Thank you very much. Absolutely.